Hi kids, my name is Sitlali and welcome to our Lifehouse Kids Online. We are starting a new series today called I Spy. What are some of the things you can spy with your little eyes? Well, this month we are going to spend some time spying things that we see that help us believe in Jesus. Today we are going to spy God's Son Jesus. Are you ready? I'd like you to gather with your family right there in your house or wherever you may be. First, we will sing some worship songs to God. Next, we will do a little activity with the baby doll. That sounds like fun. Then, we will listen to a true story from the Bible about God's Son, Jesus. Finally, we will practice our memory verse for this month and then pray and thank God because we can believe in Jesus. I can't wait. Let's all stand up and sing some worship songs to Jesus. Can you count down with me? Let me hear you. Five. Four, three, two, one.
In a world like you Everywhere I look I can see God, you make everything so wonderfully Everything is specially me I'm Poppy, and I just learned this super cool game. It's called I Spy. Someone gives you the clues, and you have to figure out the thing they're talking about. I know, I'll give you clues, and you can help spy. If you're ready to play the game, shout out I Spy. Ready? One, two, three, I Spy. Okay, here we go. I spy with my little eye. Something blue, it has strings, and it can play music. Can you guys guess what it is? Wow, you guys are good! It's a guitar! Okay, here's another one. I spy with my little eye, something that's shaped like a smile. It's yellow as a peel, and it's super yummy. You got it, it's a banana. I brought this for my snack. Hoo, 
Ho! Hey, I spy with my little eye something orange. It has feathers and it's super smart. That's right, it's Ollie. Hello, Poppy. Ho! Ho! Playing a guessing game, are you? Hey, Ollie. We're playing I Spy. It's so much fun. We spied a banana, a guitar, and you. I'm easy to spy. It's true. But there's someone more special to spy for you. So let's hear this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. I spy with my little eye. Stormy's bone! <laughs> you found it! Good job, Stormy Jane. Oh, hi friends! I'm Carrie the dog walker and this is my best dog, Stormy Jane. We were just playing I spy, but I know you came here for a story. Do you think we could keep playing I spy while we tell the story? You do? Great! Okay, so today's true story from the Bible begins a long time ago when God sent an angel to a woman named Mary. Does anyone see an angel? Make some binoculars like this and look with me. I spy with my little eye an angel. The angel had a very special message for Mary. She was going to have a baby boy. The baby's name would be Jesus and he would be God's son. Jesus is very special because Jesus is God's son. Mary and Joseph traveled to a city called Bethlehem. Do you see a city? Look with me, ready? I spy with my little eye a city called Bethlehem. When Mary and Joseph got to Bethlehem, they had to stay in a stable where animals live. Mary and Joseph rested and waited for baby Jesus to be born. Then it happened. Jesus was born. Let's look for baby Jesus. Ready? I spy with my little eye. Jesus! Mary wrapped baby Jesus and laid him in a manger. Now Jesus didn't just stay a baby. He grew up and did amazing things only he can do. Jesus told a thunderstorm to stop, and it stopped. Jesus made sick people all better. Jesus even fed over 5,000 people with just a few pieces of bread and fish. Jesus did so many amazing things. The people who saw Jesus do these amazing things wrote them down. And now we can read the stories in the Bible. These stories teach us that Jesus is real and can do amazing things. Now we all can believe in Jesus. <laughs> oh, hey, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who can believe in Jesus? I can believe in Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can believe in Jesus? I can believe in Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you next time. Bye. <laughs> So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus is God's son, the most special thing to spy for you. Thanks, Ali. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Jesus is God's son. He did so many amazing things. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it. Good. Hmm. Hey, I spy with my little eye something blue. It's a book and has stories about Jesus. Can you guess what it is? That's right, it's a Bible. And I'm gonna spy two stories about the best thing ever, Jesus. story today was about God's son Jesus. We learned how baby Jesus was born and how he grew up to do amazing things that only he can do. 
People who saw Jesus do these amazing things, like walk on water and heal sick people, wrote down what they saw. Their stories are in the Bible. Now we can read about what people saw Jesus do, and we can believe in Jesus. That's why when I ask you, who can believe in Jesus? I want you to say, I can believe in Jesus. Ready? Who can believe in Jesus? I can believe in Jesus. Yes, you can believe in Jesus because he loves you. And the Bible verse we are learning even says the stories in the Bible are written so that we can believe in Jesus. It says, these are written so that you may believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God, John 20, 31. That means the people wrote down what they saw Jesus do so that we can believe in Jesus too. Wow, let's stand up and say that together with the motions. These are written so that you may believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God. John 20, 31. Great job. Let's try that one last time. These are written so that you may believe that Jesus the Christ is the Son of God. John 20, 31. Great job. High fives for everyone. You can go ahead and give someone a high five too. There are so many great stories about Jesus in the Bible, and the best part is they are all true. Now, let's go ahead and talk to God and thank Him because we can believe in Jesus. Dear God, Jesus did so many amazing things that only He can do. Thank you for all the people who wrote down what they saw Jesus do so that we can read about it and believe in Jesus too. I pray we will all read the Bible and believe in your son, Jesus. We love you, God, in Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for praying with me. That's all the time we have today. Make sure you take some time to share with someone in your family one of the things you learned about today. Also, ask your parents to go to this video's description box to get more activities to do with you so you can always remember that we can believe in Jesus too. I'll see you next time. Bye.